we are, June 1st, 2013. Should be a fun day. I'm going to uh, make a few short videos and try to clip them together. Um, I'm going to be cleaning out the pond today. So I'm going to be getting the fish first step out of here. I'm going to be putting water into there and then getting fish out of here and then putting them in there. And then I'm going to drain the pond completely and um, go to Home Depot, wash, rent a power washer and uh, go to town. I want to have water back in this thing by tonight. So video one, done. See you in a little bit. All right, clean up video two. Um, I got most of it drained out. This is actually the furthest I've drained probably ever. All my fish are kind of just sitting down there in a tight little group. I gotta count them, make sure they're all there. Make sure there's not one in that pipe. But I'm going to pull them out now and then put them in here, their new temporary home. And uh, then I'm gonna go to Home Depot and rent a uh, pressure washer. All right, that's it. I'm out, see you soon. Pond cleanup vid three. I got all 10 fish out. That was a chore. It took me about 45 minutes. Um, go figure, Betty was the last one to put up a fight. Um, but that's done. I knew that was going to be one of the hardest parts. So now the fun begins. I'm going to Home Depot. I'm going to get a pressure washer. I'm going to get my sump pump in there. Put some stuff around it so it doesn't clog too bad. And we're going to go to town. So I will report back once I'm uh, doing me some pressure washer. That should be fun, man. I'm excited. I'm pumped. All right, part four, I gotta speak up. I just rented this bad boy. $55 for four hours, that's insane. But I needed it. Um, I mean, you could rent a, a truck for 20. But anyway, I got it, it looks pretty bad arch. And uh, I'm ready to go, and we're gonna go ahead and check it out. I don't know how long I can do this one-handed, but let's see what it does. Here we go. Pretty good job. I'm not too focused on it, so. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and finish this up. I'm gonna go ahead and finish this up and uh, and come back and we'll check out the results. Yeah, that thing worked like a charm. So, although it was 55 bucks, which is a lot, at least it did the job. I only did one run through right now, and I was afraid it wasn't gonna get all the stained algae on there, but it got everything off. And uh, there's still some more on the uh, liner and whatnot, but I'm going to give that another run, and that should take all that off. I just want to take a quick video of the first run through, and it uh, it just took it all off. I don't think I'm going to have to use my sump pump either. It doesn't put out a whole lot of water, so I think I could probably just use my handy little thing there just to drain it out as I'm going along. So I'm going to go ahead and really crank it out. I got my vacuum out, and I'm going to go ahead and uh, get it cleaned up and then give it another shoot. But this thing works awesome. You, sir awesome okay I pretty much did two run throughs with the um, pressure washer I'm gonna go ahead and do one more but I forgot how nasty it is down there that's really the last last spot I gotta clean up I forgot about all those kids rocks thrown in there they must have thrown 80 rocks in there so I'm gonna get down in there and clean the rest of those out and then I'm gonna go ahead and shoot it with the pressure washer one more time um, I got my plants right here I'm gonna put those suckers in, and then uh, Deuce is gonna supervise, and then we'll go ahead and get back to it. Should be putting water in soon, hopefully by the end, but it looks like it might rain, so I don't know. She's about as clean as she's ever been. Uh, a lot of work, I think I'm pretty much done with the pressure washer now, um, but it did a great job. I mean, everything's pretty much clean, except for a couple small stains on the liner, but you can't see those once they're, uh, once they're rolled in. So. Down here wasn't too bad. I'm getting ready to put the rocks back in there. That's the next step. And then this was the real pain. And I got some water under the liner, so I'm going to have to buy a pump and get that out of there. But everything else is pretty good. I got about another 45 minutes before I got to take this um, this pressure washer back. So I'm going to see what I can get done, and then I'll come back to it and see where we're at. Slow move. Quick vid, probably the second before the last. I'm starting to get some water in it now. I just want to get some in. I don't want to quite go up to the basket because I got to put those plants in, but I put the other plants in. Inacris, that was the name I was forgetting. Um, so I got the Inacris there and I got the Parrot Feather here and I just want to get them uh, in some water. So I'm going to fill it up to about just below the basket and then uh, take that sucker back 
and then come back and do the final video of how everything looks. Should be real clean, man. These fish are going to be happy and healthy. Is that Cheerios? Cheerios. Cheerios! Everything was going so smoothly until I ran out and took the power washer back and it rained, which just caused a whole chain of reaction. Um, first of all, the water went up too high and got into my skimmer box, causing all that crap water in there to leak into the pond. So I had to drain the whole thing again. And then, since there was a hole there, since it, I mean, it poured. So then, um, since it was empty down, down there, um, it started, uh, started to close in underneath it. So that filled up with water. So I had to go spend $70 on a pump, which I got right here. But... It's almost seven o'clock. It's coming together. I got my plants in. So they look good. I got this cord running around because it was going to the pump. Water looks really clear. Clear. Clear and clean. So I got the fish all tucked away, ready to go to bed. I'm gonna get this thing cycling right now. So that's where we're at. It's kind of a longer video, but I ran into a jam. About a two hour jam. Crap. That's all right. It's all good. Here it is. Come what around. a day. Um, I got the duck be gone on there because the ducks are around, but the water is just pristine glass. I should have kept the fountain off so I can get a good look. But I mean, you can just see everything in there now. Plants are looking good. I, uh, I'm trying to replant those irises. I don't know if they're going to grow or not, but I think they will. And then I've got some, um, oh, I forgot the name of them in the middle, but something in the middle. But anyway, uh... Look how clear it is. So there it is. What a day. Busy day. Crazy day. 7 p.m. Took me all day. But I did it. All oh, the lights came on. I don't know why they came on. Because it's raining. Alright, that's a wrap. I think I got seven videos. I'll go ahead and... Make them all one.